Today marks two years since 15-year-old Chelsea Johnson was found stabbed to death in Fairfield. This afternoon, her family and friends stood in front of the Butler County Courthouse to protest why her murder case hasn't been brought to trial. Night on your side's Butler and Warren County reporter Jay Warren is live in Hamilton with this developing story. Jay? Well, Clyde, today a spokesperson for the Fairfield Police Department said his agency is confident they know who killed Chelsea Johnson, which of course has the family wondering why then this case hasn't been brought to a grand jury. The Butler County prosecutor, Mike Moser, says that Fairfield still needs to do more with this case before it is brought to the grand jury. Now, today, Johnson's mother, Vicki Feibel, was holding a sign that said justice for Chelsea. She was joined by friends and family who wonder again why it's two years and still the case has not made it to trial. This group of people has lashed out at the Fairfield Police Department and the prosecutor's office. They say they resorted to this public demonstration to in the hopes that it will press the various agencies to move forward. In the meantime, Feibel says that every day has been a torment for her and her son. I wish I could say what I feel, but I can't because I'm sure I'd be locked up, but I can't take it no more. My son has nightmares every night. We gotta leave doors open until we get peace, until he's locked up. Now the Fairfield spokesman also says that the case was turned over to the prosecutor's office. That is a situation the prosecutor said, no, it's still Fairfield's. Uh, today that spokesperson called me back and said, in fact, that the prosecutor's office is working with the Fairfield Police Department to go over that case and make sure it's tightened up. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, Hamilton.